What's going on guys? Welcome to the video. Another match just finished up. It was Netherlands versus New Zealand in the Women's World Cup and I really expected a better game. Now, I'm not saying the game was bad, I'm just thinking goal-wise I was expecting more. Um, New Zealand's goalkeeper did quite well. Uh, we all know the Netherlands are a great team. They're very attacking and they score a lot of goals. I've seen them in Ireland a few times. Um, I've seen them play. They have great players. They have players playing all over the world. They have players playing for Lyon who won the Champions League three years in a row. They have League Martins playing for FC Barcelona. You just have so much talent in one team. And to only win 1-0, I was kind of shocked. Um, New Zealand did quite well. They tried to hold them off. But in the 92nd minute, Netherlands scored. And, you know, I saw it happening. I just knew. I was like, they they have to win this game. They're not going to be happy if they leave with a, a draw, a scoreless draw. This is the Netherlands we're talking about. And, yeah, they, they got the win. The most needed three points. And they got it. But, um, yeah, I was expecting better. I was in work watching the game. I brought my iPad because... You know, just just to have it on in the background. I have to I have to keep up with all the games. I missed the game last night because uh, I went to watch Ireland play the the men's team in the Euro 2020 qualifiers. So I kind of had a bit of withdrawals because I missed uh, the the games from yesterday. So had to watch today's game. Going in to give blood now, and in the meantime, I will watch the next match. And um, I'll check back in with you later, and you know we'll talk about scores and stuff. But um, yeah. So 92nd minute winner. From, I think her name was Rurd. Um, I'm not sure exactly her first name. But it was a good goal. It was uh, swung in, I think, by Leek Martins. And the ball was... Try the, the defender the defender from New Zealand tried to clear it. Um, Shanice Van Sennen was there also kind of putting pressure on her. And the ball went to the girl Nord or Rurd, whatever her name is. And she headed it. Keeper went to it. Another defender went to it. And... She just headed it to the ground and it bounced in. Bounced in. Not the most amazing of goals, but um, we saw it coming. They did play well. They were very attacking. Um, and I, I will say the New Zealand goalkeeper did very well to stop a few. Also, guys, there was something really surprising. When I was watching the match, I noticed the flags for both countries. So the Netherlands flag and then the New Zealand flag. And I thought, hang on, this, this is wrong. This is the Australian flag. So I googled it and it turns out Australians, Australia's flag and the New Zealand's flag are like the exact same minus there's an additional star on one of them. It's below the the Great British flag. Um, and I got really confused because I was always certain that the, the All Blacks kind of flag was the New Zealand flag. I thought it was black and white, hence why their kit was black and white. Their crest is also the, the flower, or no, not the flower, the the feather or leaf, whatever it is. Their logo is the leaf. So why is their flag completely opposite? Like, I was so thrown. I can't believe I didn't know this because I'm really good at flags. I'm really good at countries. And I did not know that New Zealand's flag is literally the Australian flag. If you didn't know that, then I'm glad because I feel so dumb. I feel like I should have known that. Anyway guys, let me know what you thought of the match. I think New Zealand did really well. There was one player that stood out, but I can't remember her name. It was really difficult. It began with G. It began with G. The fans, I must say, the fans are really, really fun. I remember I went to Portugal a couple of years back when the World Cup was on. And I, there was just fans everywhere from Holland. And they were unbelievable. They were dancing around. They were loud. They were singing. And they were just great crack. And um, so again, I could I could see that as well in Paris. They're they're really showing up and supporting their girls. So it is great to see. Um, and later on tonight we have the USA versus Thailand. That should be a really really good game. Um, and I will be watching it. So I'll check back in later. Also, I'm going to be posting a video of my trip to the Aviva Stadium. And um, it's a little little vlog. So I'll be posting that. And I have amazing seat so i hope you check that video out if you're new to the channel hit subscribe drop a like on the video and i will see you for the next one